Hey, want to hear the most annoying sound in the world? Hello everyone, welcome back to another Road to Elite Smash, and if you'll remember, back in February, we managed to get our worst character, Peach, into Elite Smash, just barely, and after struggling for a long time, too. But unfortunately, this doesn't mean we're done with dealing with our worst character, because Peach has an Echo Fighter, and when it comes to Echo Fighters, at least with this one, Daisy plays the exact same way. So we're going to be playing our worst character again, this time with a different skin, and this time we're going to get her to end elite. Alright, Toon Link is fine to start us off, but at least with Daisy, just it's really just throwing projectiles back and forth. It might be a little boring, but that's just what we're going to have to do. Alright. Trying to do down throw in the back here, that's a true combo at low percents. Uh, forward air again, still as good as Peach's being the exact same as they with at least JC being an Echo Fighter. Normally with Echo Fighters they have at least some sort of a difference in movesets. As we're gonna take another stock off of two and three, but get back with the words. But yeah, DC's moveset is the exact same as Peach's. It's basically a reskin. Toad still being a terrible counter. Actually the wind pushing it back, so we're gonna unfortunately miss our golf club. Alright. Alright, he didn't go for the bomb. Oh, that's actually gonna clash right there. That's gonna have to take some, take some damage from that. Alright, good tennis racket. Oh, and the stitch is active. I don't think he's able to get back. Nope. Good thing to pull the stitch out just like that. You do a lot of damage and just enough to get him out of there. Alright, let's see if we can get a kill. Not just yet. It's a 58, so need to wait a little bit longer. Okay. Alright, good down smash. This turn up doesn't get the bounce. Another down smash. This surprise turn up. Let's get him. Just kidding. Good forward air. That's why it's good to have a long range forward air. In case your turn up misses, you can always come back. Alright, looks like we have Roy again. Well, I think Roy could pose a challenge, but. As long as he doesn't get too aggressive and we can play a little bit safe, then I think we should be fine. I gotta remember that Dizzy's recovery just isn't that good, so I can't go too deep off stage, even though his recovery is not that good. Ooh, sliding up tilt. I like this. Alright, jump. Okay, yeah, no jump. And because I don't have a jump, my recovery sucks, I'm not just gonna lose the stock. Can I just kill him now? He's at 165. Watch this. Okay. That was not just like really weird in terms of hitboxes and where the squeak hit is. Alright. Alright, forward throw. Oh yeah, he didn't jump because he didn't check it. Not yet. Uh, ooh, nice! We got the dress skin, but at least once. I know we did that a lot with Peach, and I think that's just going to be a helpful thing to do with Daisy as well. A few moments later. There's a turn up. And then the dress gap once again. We got it twice in the same match. I gotta tell you, it's weird how it works, but when it works, it works really well. Hmm, Donkey Kong. That's a really easy matchup for us right here. Hopefully, we shouldn't lose, even if we're our worst character. Uh, there we go. Get out the counter. Alright, double slap. A little bit low, but we got the job not to cover. And we double jump with the forward air. <laughs> Alright, let's get back here. We have Winky turn up. It's the up smash. He's getting a lot more than I would expect. That never works, so don't try that. Get some down air action. Uh, Alright, I thought I was going to force it off stage, but that works too, I guess. Man, he likes to air dodge a lot. He has that turn up conversion off really early. Alright, now we're floating. In the down here. Trying to get some something off of there. Was oh, he dead? No, not quite. I thought I was gonna get him really early. Oh, he killed himself. <laughs> he just get himself back. No recovery needed. All right, easy counter because he's going for dash attack. 
that's fine too. Oh, yeah. Eh, we'll take that. Sucks hitbox, but you know, what can you do? DQ chicken flamethrower. Watch this. <laughs> okay, well, that's one way to have me win really easily. Really easy to just punish what he did. Alright, now that we're just good. You what? Go to the next one. Get some tennis racket damage. Alright. Oh, easy counter. Unfortunately, that just doesn't kill because Daisy's counter is pretty bad. And another tennis racket, too. Wow. And we've only taken 27% of this whole match. You can just easily tree stock him right now. Oh man, the jab actually stopped our dash attack. Now we're gonna get this one. Alright. Ooh, alright. This is some most combos you will see me do with Daisy. Good forward air. Alright. Played it safe there. Okay. Alright, he does not have the turn up. He can't stage spike me. It's a down smash. Let's get that turn up. Go for down air in this hit and mix it up. And the hip check back air is gonna close out the three stock. Gotta tell you, that DK was pretty easy to handle. But hey, maybe it's his worst character as well. You picked the wrong escalator! Well, it's about time we got ourselves another Falcon freebie. I have been missing Falcon on a lot of my Elite Smash runs. But uh, now we have our own Falcon to torment ourselves. Alright. This will be easy slash hard. Because, obviously, Daisy stuff. I think we'll be able to use a lot of Psybe more just because of Falcon's aggression. As you can see right here. We have Ben Smash up. Yeah, and using that float to, to bait him into going for a spike move would be pretty helpful. He's at 160, so I think we can kill him pretty soon. Like that down smash right there. Now we have Winky Face turn up on the field just right now. See, we can just bait him into doing stuff like that with the float. And just pull him forward. Get that forward air. Alright. Ah, we missed the dress skin, but it's alright. Gonna get the down throw. Oh, it's a little too low. And I'm punched for it. Oh yeah, well. Now we get that back here at least. Okay. Nothing so far. Alright, at least dodge that. Another down smash. Alright, not quite, and no dress camp this time either. Good forward here. Oh! With the stitch! Oh, there's the smite! Blow down there. Alright. No dress camp for the third time. Put the hip check. Not the back air this time, but the side B. Hit him straight in the head. As we're gonna take a Falcon freebie that we've been missing for so long. And I haven't seen a Terry in a while either. Should be pretty interesting. I don't know if I've played against a Terry in this matchup before, but that should be the first time for everything at least. Alright. Down to a back air. Alright. Alright, it's 117. I doesn't pop shield just yet. We'll get the counter, and that actually kills. Pretty surprising, is most of the time, Toad's counter can just never kill. Alright, down air is a little too high. You get the F tilt. And the forward air is not enough to reach. Alright, nice. Okay. Ah. Yeah, I can't let go of shield because he can just buffer down tilt and get some free hits off of us and convert that into anything. And yeah, we'll judge it again, because I let go of shield. He's pretty low himself, and now he's a go meter, as we have our surprise turn up on him. Alright, not yet. All right. It was at this moment Jackson knew. He died. Ooh, the tennis racket to the nuts, but he's not dead just yet. Oh, I missed the snipe. Oh, but there's the dress snipe. Oh, no way he's back. Oh, but the, the dress snipe. Okay. That was a whirlwind of emotions just there. I dress get him twice. But he made it back the first time. And that was pretty exciting. Well, it looks like our final matchup is not going to be a good one as we got Falco. Falco's just going to reflect all of our turnips. He can even reflect Toad's counter, which could be really bad for us. Alright. Plus, he could just camp us with lasers. Nothing we can do nope. about it. See, this is what I was talking about with reflecting Toad's counter. Just got to be careful as to when I counter. Like, I. Nope! Yeah, I, I can't do that because he could just approach like that. Alright, good forward air. 
Oh. Well, it looks like he SD'd that fast. Alright. I mean, we take those. Uh, I wanted to get him with the dress skin so I could catch him off stage and kill him at like one. Alright. Oh, I got the turnip snipe. He can make it back though. Alright, that's not enough. But that winky turnip gonna wink him into the stage. Everything makes no sense to me. This is looking really good. We have three stocks already. And look at that. Yay! We're able to hold on to all three. He did SD twice, but we take those and get our worst character into Lead Smash once and for all. I gotta say, Daisy is really hard to play along with Peach, and I'm so glad I never have to touch these characters again. They were an absolute nightmare to play, and as long as you've only seen my winning matches, there were a lot more losing matches, I can assure you that. It was very frustrating in general. I think it's weird though how they switched it up with her projectile being her down B and her counter being her neutral B because it's weird. You have to switch that up really, f like, like, you know, change your whole mindset because every other counter is a, is always down B. It's never been neutral B at, at all. It's always been down B. And that's the thing with projectiles. The only time it's really down B is if you're playing Link and you have, or, you know, Richter, or Simon, the Belmonts. And you're just flaming that. But even then, you have like two other projectiles. So it's you're in that sort of projectile mindset where you're just like, yeah, 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 I'm throwing stuff. But yeah, that's really all I have to say. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to leave a like down below, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next video. And until then, peace out and make it a great day, everyone.